Advancements in preventative medicine have opened new pathways to proactively monitor our health. As interest in personalized wellness continues to increase, one company has entered the space with optimized full body imaging, Pernuvo. Pernuvo is a direct-to-consumer multi-specialty group. We offer imaging services directly to patients. A whole body MRI, in our opinion, is the most efficient way to get ahead of diseases, to detect them when they are early. At a price point of $2,500, Pernuvo offers patients a non-invasive, full medical assessment of their anatomy, including the brain, skeletal, respiratory, urinary, and nervous systems. Celebrities like Kim Kardashian and TV host Maria Menounos have praised the scan as life-saving. Doesn't use any ionizing radiation, so there's no cancer risk. And we don't even have to do a pinprick, we don't even have to do a needle in the clinic, because we use what's called non-contrast imaging. To gain insight into my personal health, I booked a scan at their 34th Street Clinic in New York. With plenty of snacks and healthy beverages available in the common areas, Pernuvo feels more like a meta spa than a hospital or a doctor's office. After completing the medical intake form, I was given a private changing room, put on some cozy scrubs, then headed into the MRI lab to meet with the radiologist. Despite some nerves, I was relieved to discover the scan chamber is specially designed to reduce claustrophobia. Within the scanner, we have some unique innovations here. We have a, a system of mirrors that lets the patient actually watch TV and stream things like Netflix while they're in the MRI scanner. The company's custom-built MRI scanners are uniquely calibrated to produce comprehensive, diagnostic quality images, all in under one hour. So we look at the whole body head to toe. Some parts we go and zoom in and do it even higher resolution, like the brain and the spine, and especially the prostate. And we see large things that are technically organs, like all the muscles, right? We see muscles, we see fat, we see bones. Um, we see bones differently than you see them on an X-ray or a CT, but we actually see the inner part of the bone, the marrow. We see that better on MRI and with more detail. Pernuvo scans for more than 500 different conditions, including kidney stones, cancer, and degenerative changes throughout the body, and can detect risk factors leading to diseases like diabetes. We're diagnosing something definitively. If we see something like fatty liver or an aneurysm, you're never going to know if you have that unless you get imaged. There are other things uh, where we might see a tumor. A minority of patients, something like 5%, will get information that yes, they may have something quite serious, and we will make a recommendation as to what types of follow-up testing and specialists that they should see. Dr. Duran says the imaging practice isn't meant to replace physicians, but instead allows a more generalist approach for patients curious about their health in conjunction with annual checkups. It sort of begs for what can we do to empower that primary care model? What can we do to augment it? As we go into this future where primary care has to be hyper-efficient, and where the information you get out of that interaction becomes super important because there's so many different therapies it could lead to, we think it begs for a partner. Pernuvo currently operates outside of health insurance coverage, and while the price point may seem a bit high, the company has recently partnered with life insurance providers like John Hancock for discounted scans. Patients are also eligible to use their FSA or HSA accounts to cover the cost. A week following my scan, I was notified that my results were in. The medical reports and images are first published in the Pernuvo app and displayed in an accessible, categorized way, with easy-to-understand language outlining each finding. I was then set up with a virtual one-on-one -on -one with a healthcare professional to further interpret the findings. They picked up a mucus retention cyst in your right maxillary sinus. If you ever had a cold or had congestion, you feel that your right side of your face has more pressure than the left. That's what this is. The heart looks good. Esophagus and the stomach clear. They are picking up mild degenerative spondyloarthropathic changes in your cervical spine. So the neck is showing mild wear and tear. Running around New York City, carrying camera gear around. Oftentimes everything is strapped to my back. So maybe hire someone to do that work. <laughs> Overall, a clean bill of health. We're seeing human biology unfold year to year, decade to decade. We're learning things about how the body and the organs and the skeletal system and the brain, how they, how they morphologically, how their structure and anatomy changes with time. Looking towards the future, the company is also investing heavily into artificial intelligence. We do have some internal AI work and we've used that largely for research purposes. What the future looks like is a massive amount of imaging data and other data like genomic data that was never available before. And then there will be pretty much per capita the same number or less physicians to care for 
an increasingly large and, and older population. So the only way for that physician and, and other provider kind of layer to deliver care well is to have some kind of AI, honestly, that sifts through it. Skeptics in the medical community have expressed concern over MRI scans for asymptomatic patients. Some experts believe the data from these scans can potentially cause people stress and anxiety over benign findings and lead them to seek further treatment unnecessarily. Skepticism is healthy in medicine. And I think that we are a really innovative company. And like a lot of innovative companies, there's a reason we exist. You look at medical innovations that are being used to deal with different parts of the healthcare access crisis. There are things like AI enabled chatbots and all kinds of wearables and apps on your cell phone. And a lot of these things I think are fairly radical departures from conventional medicine. Pronuvo is different than that. We are a medical practice. With $70 million raised in funding, the company is growing fast. Pronuvo currently operates 11 different centers in eight states, with ambitions to expand into more cities and scale internationally. In attaining that larger scale, we'll be able to help as many people as possible and also uh, get to the size where we can start uh, to potentially reduce price and make it more accessible for larger numbers of people. For Cheddar, I'm Chris Castellino.